Gut. Nein. Hello everybody, it's Lenny. How are you all doing? I'm once again here with my cousin Hi, Zoe. Hi everybody, how are you? And as you know, we are in Belgium. I'm living in Brussels and my cousin is a bit further away. But we both speak the French language of Belgium. So yeah. today we're going to challenge, well I'm going to challenge Zoe rather because I'm bilingual. Um, and I'm going to tell her some uh, typical English idioms and she's going to try and interpret them the way she thinks. Thanks. I think they it's going to be, be weird. It's going to be weird. <laughs> this is an inside, inside, uh, inside my head. Inside her head. <laughs> yeah. So we'll see if it works out. It could just turn out to be a really funny video with absolutely yeah. no meaning at all. But if that's the way it goes, you well, can try at home. Yeah, you can try at home. Well, um, most of you already speak English, I suppose. But maybe you'll learn a few uh, words in French. Maybe you'll just have a good old laugh with us. I don't know. Yeah. Just enjoy. Yeah. Shut up and enjoy. <laughs> What do you think beating around the bush means? Beating? Beating. Beating like, like yeah. <laughs> around the bush. The bush. Ah, the bush, okay. When you say bush, I see the bush in Australia. You know? Oh, it yeah. It sounds like a bush. Okay. No bush. Um, oh, I don't know. Um, cut the trees. Do you think it means you if I say stop beating around the bush? Stop beating around the bush. What do you think I'm saying to you? Stop to be upset of everything and want to... <laughs> to beat the bush <laughs> now! To Stop trying to beat the tree! Make, make the bash! <laughs> it's for the party! I don't know, it's a weird expression, <laughs> no? In, in French, it's actually... Tourner autour du pot. Really? Yeah. No! So um, avoiding a topic. So you're beating around the bush and you can say, stop beating around the bush, just get to the point. So weird. <laughs> I think it's like for somebody are really upset, just screaming, want to <laughs> crush everything. It's just, stop screaming around the bush! Stop breaking everything! Don't yeah, break the stop. tree! Hold down! That actually makes more sense, like, stop breaking the tree, it didn't oh. do anything to you. <laughs> Weird expression. <laughs> we have a lot of weird expressions, but I think every every language is gonna have weird yeah. expressions. In Belgium, people. I have a lot of <laughs> expression. Even the Belgium don't know. Yeah, <laughs> it's yeah. really weird. <laughs> yeah, and also Belgium is a, a bilingual country, so one side will have expressions, the other side will have expressions that we won't understand. Yeah. The French-speaking side of Belgium will not have the same expressions as yeah. people from France or. You know, all that, all that jazz. I don't know why I'm going on It's on too long. It's, it's too long. Too long. <laughs> too long. <laughs> Let's get right to it. <laughs> okay, this one you might already know what it means. Um, what do you think means burning the midnight oil? Midnight oil? Yeah, like uh, imagine uh, an oil lamp and mm. you're burning oh, the midnight okay. oil. I saw olive oil in the kitchen. <laughs> olive oil? Yeah, she's a, she's a cook. So she, yeah, she I sad. always <laughs> think about food. Is for that. So, midnight, burning the midnight hole. It's a um, good thing late at home for a body. It's almost that, actually. It's yeah. uh, working late. Oh, you can what? Say, yeah, so you, you can come to your office and you see somebody that's still there and it's like past midnight or like in early oh, yeah. and like, Oh, you're burning the midnight oil today or oh, tonight. Oh, okay. Does that one make more sense than the first one? Yeah, <laughs> because when you said midnight or oh, I was like, oh, at midnight, I don't really understand. <laughs> no, no like, I think it's in reference to the, the light. Oh, the yeah. Oil, okay. the no, oil, the oil. Oil, oil, the coconut <laughs> Burning oil. the olive oil in the kitchen. No, at yeah. midnight, I was like, <laughs> I think something I don't understand. <laughs> what does it mean to cry over spilled milk? Cry over to spill milk. Uh, crying over milk that has been spilt. Ah, oh, okay. Oh, it's crying for nothing. Yeah, it's crying for something that already happened. The milk is already spilt, so we can oh. Say, oh, it's no use. You're you're crying over spilt milk. Okay, or... it's like crying for something happened like one years ago. Yeah, something oh, okay. that's already passed. And yeah, the milk is spilt, so there's nothing you can do. It's sad. <laughs> I didn't have my meal. <laughs> Stop crying over spilled milk. Yeah. Nothing you can do anyway. 
Okay, this one is actually very similar to an expression we have in French. So oh. let's see if you can recognize it. Let's it's see. killing two birds with one stone. <laughs> so killing the bird with two birds, two with birds. one stone. Okay. Uh, there's, an, there's an expression that means the same thing in French with a stone. Yeah, no. no. <laughs> so what uh, do you think you, you you are really 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 lucky because you can kill two birds with <laughs> one stone. That's a good. Yeah, that's kind of good. It doesn't mean that though. It's oh, actually okay. the French one I was thinking of. The faire. Une pierre de coups. Une pierre de coups. Oui, je la connais. Translating in my head, <laughs> it didn't work. <laughs> yeah. So it means you can do two things in one step. Yeah, basically. Yeah. It's not. I'm lucky. I kill two birds. Yeah. <laughs> so what do you think letting the cat out of the bag means? Mm, what? <laughs> letting the cat out of the bag. <laughs> okay, like the animals. Yeah. <laughs> out the bag. Yeah, a bag. So you let inside the, or you're letting it out, out of the bag. You can say, "Oh, the cat's out of the bag now," or you let the cat out of the bag. No, actually, you can't say that. It's more like, "Oh, the cat's out of the bag now." What do you think? It's so <laughs> that weird. Could why? Why you want to put the cat into a bag? <laughs> I actually don't know the it's uh, the history of that one. <laughs> okay, uh, I think it's. What's your guess? Let it go. Say it. No, it's kind of that. It's it's um, sharing information that was concealed before. Okay. So if there's like a secret, or maybe like a girl is pregnant and she doesn't want to know, but then she reveals it, then the cat's out of the bag because the truth is the out. Cat out of the cat's out of the bag. Yeah, it's totally normal. You're pregnant. It's like the truth is out, so the cat is out of the bag. I don't know why the cat symbolizes truth. Maybe I should have researched it before. Yeah. But yeah, cat's out of the bag. Yeah, maybe. They want to kill the cat into a bag. Maybe I don't know. I have no clue what that one could be. I'll, so I'll look weird. it up after. I'm actually interested. So the last one you might already know because it's food related. Yeah, piece of cake. Oh, it's really easy to do. Yay! Yeah, it's going to be a piece of cake. Piece of cake. Did you guys already know all these idioms before this video? Probably because they're really known ones. But don't hesitate to tell me in the comments some idioms from where you are from and uh, with their strange literal translations. We all have them in every single language. Some yeah. of them are really funny. In Netherlands. <laughs> in Netherlands. Well, in Dutch. That's how we say Dutch. it. In Dutch, oh, in yeah. French, in, in every language. We, Russia. We're not going to. All the languages. <laughs> or you can do it, but I'll, I'll, just go, I'll just go do shopping without you, and you can just say all the yeah, all the countries. I know. <laughs> so yeah, leave them in the comments below. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. I had a lot of fun doing them. Yeah. I hope you had fun too. Yeah, <laughs> I discovered weird expression from your country. It was really fun. Yeah, and I think I chose some really common ones. I didn't go like in the really underground world of idioms yeah, where I you. <laughs> because <laughs> after that it's going to be too hard yeah we, we kept it basic but don't hesitate to tell me what you thought your special idioms or some things that translate strangely from one language to another those are really funny I, yeah. when I read them um, <clears throat> I'm losing my voice <laughs> <laughs> Anyway, if you enjoyed this video guys, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if yeah. you haven't already. And don't forget to click on the bell. I don't know why I'm doing that. I'm gonna have to insert a bell icon hey. every time. Hey. <laughs> click on the bell icon down below to be notified for more content. And uh, yep, I will see you very soon in another Yay. video. Bye! I you all guys, bye!